Hi folks, it's Camille from Food Foraging Australia. If you like these videos, please like and subscribe. So I'm just here at my local park to come and show you this beautiful plant, which is the wild onion. So its scientific name is the Allium triquetrum. Now when it comes to identifying this, uh, pretty obvious that the white bell flowers are a good way of knowing that you have an Allium triquetrum, uh, but also the most distinctive feature of this is the flower actual stalks are triangular. So they, the stalks actually have three sides, as you can see there, which is where it gets its name triquetrum. Um, so the whole plant is edible. Um, the green aerial parts taste exactly like an onion or an onion crossed with a garlic. Um, and the bulbs can be used like a garlic as well. Or the leaf, the, the leaves of these are exactly like um, green onion. So you can add them into your soups and your stews or um, into your salads for a little bit of flavour. Now the medicinal properties of this is exactly as the Allium family or the onions. Uh, it's antibacterial topically, so you can crush the leaves and place it onto wounds to avoid getting bacterial infections. Um, and it's also fantastic for um, killing funguses as well on the skin. Um, so yeah, there you have it. It, it, it actually grows um, very commonly near water. Now, um, a note about water plants is that you need to be really careful with what kind of water that they're growing around. Because water plants, um, if they're growing in water that is very polluted, um, so like downstream of a town or near any sewer, uh, sewer uh, pipes, they tend to build up heavy metals in their tissues, like lead. So you need to be making sure that if you're uh, foraging near any kind of water, that the water is um, either upstream of a town or is unpolluted. Um, so then you can avoid any of the heavy metals in the plants. So there you have it, the Allium triquetrum or the wild garlic. If you find it out while you're foraging, give it a go. You can taste, you can eat it raw or cooked. So just pluck a leaf and then have a taste. And I'm sure you will be quite pleasantly surprised with its flavour. Um, and again, if you enjoy these videos, please like and subscribe and happy foraging.